Here's a quick tutorial on how to create a shoe sole using the outline of your foot. So I'm going to create a new document. Shoe sole. Okay. Then I am going to upload. I already sketched my foot. So I'm going to create a new element. I'm going to import. And that is here or is it here okay. here it is right here Humphrey foot upload it and there we go okay so now I can create a sketch on one of these I'll put it on here and then in here now, once I'm there, here it is right here. You may have to look under this drop down because it may be hidden, but it's under this drop down, insert image, Humphrey foot. And I have to draw a rectangle here. See, it says it appears as draw image rectangle. Okay, so there's my foot. Now what I need to do, I want to get it appropriate size since I did an eight and a half by 11. So I will dimension this at 8.5 and this at 11. Okay, so that gets me so that it's appropriate size. So now I'm going to do this real quickly. I'm going to use the spline. Again, there's no one here. I'm going to use the spline. And just start and just kind of you'll see as I go it kind of curves as I go to I don't want to completely follow my foot because it is a shoe after all that would be an awfully personalized shoe but this way and your student and you'll like it because you know it's personal then when I come up here I can kind of do a give me a little room to wiggle my toes and then I got to come back. I'm going to zoom in because I want to get right on there. Okay. Now you might get this up here, and I'm not quite sure on this one, but I'm going to finish that sketch. And then I'm going to extrude. You see, there it is. I'm going to extrude it. That might be a little much. Go down here, so I do it about a half an inch, and that all goes away, and that's there. You know, if I see it, I want to see it. This is there, but then it's, and I'm going to turn off these guys, visibility on these planes. And now you would be able to, if you think of that as the top, think of this as the bottom, make your sketch on here, and start making a tread of some sort like in my other tutorial to make the actual so that when you get done I'll leave that the idea is you're going to end up with here's one that's done I believe you know you'll have something along these lines, but it'll be your shape, which is kind of cool. So that that's the idea is that you can make it more personal. And I think that's basically it.